Families, a big part of the grieving process is remembering what made the people they loved so special. NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith is at the Memorial at City Hall and continues our coverage. Yeah, well, today we spoke with one cousin who is grieving a tragic loss that, as you can imagine, is so hard to comprehend. He recalls a very kind and friendly person who he says got along with everyone, very quick to strike up a conversation to get to know people and make them feel welcome. We spoke today with Jason Pro, who talked with us about his cousin, Michael Rudimetkin, who died in the mass shooting. He says it's a horrible situation and he's been on a roller coaster of emotions and keeps coming back to the question why. He says Michael welcomed people with open arms, what he calls a real rare one. That's how he describes him, that he enjoyed motorcycles and was amazing at repairing cars. According to a statement online on behalf of his parents, Michael was very passionate about his work at VTA, that he was a wonderful, caring son, brother, husband, and friend to many, that he attended Cupertino schools and was a youth minister and pastoral council member, that family was very important to him. On a go Fund me page set up for the family. There's a statement on behalf of his wife Gloria that reads in part Mike and I had 19 amazing years together full of adventures. It was not supposed to end this way. I will forever miss Michael with my entire being and grieve this tragedy with our family, friends, and community. While his cousin today shared more on the type of person he was. A lot of people looked up to Mike. Mike, he, he was never, uh, it was just. It was just always good times with Mike. You know, if uh, if you were having a hard time, you could call Mike. He'd make his way down from wherever he was at, either Cupertino, uh, Santa Cruz. We were just in Sacramento two weeks ago at a family reunion. Um, You know, uh, a couple years ago, we did a uh, a cousin's trip. Went out to, uh, actually it was for my brother's uh, bachelor party. Went up to uh, Tahoe, South Lake Tahoe. Uh, Anytime you needed Mike, he'd give you the shirt off his back. Now, the online post also goes on to say that, of course, he enjoyed spending time with his wife, their dogs, working on home projects, that he was a sports fan. He liked the 49ers, San Jose Sharks, and the Warriors. His cousin, again, shared stories about how well he treated people and that he was outgoing and, again, just so welcoming towards people. Reporting live in San Jose, Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News.